The central idea of the Brooks Adams Law of Civilization and Decay can be summarized as follows. Adams believed that the driving force behind the rise and fall of civilizations was the pursuit and accumulation of wealth. He argued that societies progress through three distinct stages, spiritual, mechanical, and economic. Spiritual Stage In this stage, societies are primarily driven by religious or spiritual motivations. People are more focused on their faith and the afterlife than on material wealth. This stage is characterized by the development of art, literature, and philosophy, as well as the establishment of religious institutions. Mechanical Stage As societies evolve, they enter the mechanical stage, where they begin to develop technologies and systems to improve their efficiency and productivity. This stage is marked by advancements in agriculture, transportation, and communication, which enable societies to accumulate wealth more effectively. Economic Stage In the final stage, societies become increasingly focused on the pursuit of wealth and material possessions. The economic stage is characterized by the growth of trade, commerce, and finance, as well as the rise of powerful economic institutions like banks and corporations. However, as societies become more focused on wealth accumulation, they also become more susceptible to corruption, inequality, and social unrest. According to Adams, the law of civilization and decay suggests that as societies progress through these stages, they eventually reach a point of decay, where their focus on wealth accumulation leads to their downfall. This decay can manifest in various forms, such as political instability, social unrest, or economic collapse. Once a society reaches this point, it is often replaced by a new civilization that begins the cycle anew.